Well, it seems the trend of picking short scripts for long fights is continuing. This is going to get me in trouble, isn't it? I really do wish I had more to talk about, but despite my personal love for Weaver, it is my favorite elite specialization in the entire game after all, I have a hard time recommending this build to anyone. Okay, maybe I'm a little bit bitter about the fact that the fresh air version of this build is no longer considered good enough. But maybe it has something to do with this build being extremely squishy, completely melee locked, having almost no utility, and the CC being generously described as mediocre that make the whole thing a bit of a hard sell. I guess it has decent mobility? Yay? Credit where credit's due, the core loop of the build, Firefire fire into Air Air, is pretty easy to grasp. And the newer version of this build that runs through Earth using Unravel actually has an extremely high DPS ceiling. Meaning if you want to put the time into this build, you actually do get rewarded with good damage payouts. We'll see how long that lasts, considering that exact set of circumstances has attracted the nerf hammer more than once. But really, if you're playing Power Weaver in its current state, you're probably more doing it because you want to play this build rather than for any practical reason. And that's alright, you know? And it means you can really kind of run whichever version you want, and it's probably still going to end up fine. In the footage, I'm running the super basic Firefire fire, Air Air Loop, because I just kind of forgot Unravel was a thing now. But look, that only became a thing, like, last December, okay? That's still new to me. And you can even simplify this further by taking Fire Elemental over Fiery Greatsword, because honestly, the damage is almost identical, and Fire Elemental is so much easier to use as long as you actually remember to resummon it which should hopefully maybe give you enough space to focus on not getting murdered the entire time. Seriously, this build alone makes me want to do a video on how to adapt DPS gear for more survivability in ways that actually make sense. Anyway, I'll leave you with the wannabe Three Stooges over here. Also, enjoy the Modern Rough theme because I messed up the audio recording. I'm sorry, it is going to happen again, and next time you can hear me gushing about my favorite build in the game that just happens to be Condi Weaver. Until then, goodbye. <laughs>